Okay. Why am I so big still? That's Pokey Beard. I would give everything for my child. Is Trash Queen here? Hey, Trash Queen. Christmas was last year, true. It happens every year, though. Let's take a piggyback him. And I guess I don't really want any of these. I think they're all kind of bad. Missile Launcher maybe is the best bet for a decent card in a pre-stack, maybe? I'm not even sure about that, but maybe. Uh, transfer Students, wonderful. Give me that. Scarab's kind of cool. I like Jeweled Scarab. Psionic Probe. Copy a spell in your opponent's deck and add it to your hand. It's kind of cool. Um, Plated Beetle's not bad either. Let's take Probe. It's fun, right? Let's go Corporal. I do like Corporal. Undying Disciple's a very strong 6. Conjurer I don't think is actually that good. It's fun, but... Let's give her a copy of a minion. That's fun too. Let's do that. More sixes? Sure. This card's cool. Cube? We have a pretty good cube deck. Holy smokes. Undying Disciple. Piggy's okay. Wouldn't mind another one for fun, but let's take the cube. Unless we're queuing into other priests, it should be pretty good. I think I'll actually take Wave here too. Don't love the card, but these are pretty underwhelming, so sure. Uh, take a nice 5 or a decent 2. It's like a decent 2. I don't really like Luminous so, so much. I found it to be very awkward. I don't know why we want all these uh, Death Rattles. But maybe there's a way. I guess we'll take a Gangster here, maybe. Eerie Statue can't attack unless it's the only minion on the battlefield. Well, kind of dumb. Oh my god, Nod Jock Hexen. That's pretty good. Malagos would not be bad at all either. One, two, three. Let's take Nod Jock Hexen. I wish I had enough dust to easily craft him in gold now too. I know I don't. Double Corporal. I was really thinking Spellstone. We passed one of these, but... Let's do it because it's fun. Good with all these death rattles for sure, right? For sure work. I guess we'll take a spirit here. Feed the uh, night captains. Fishy's good. Embalming. Actually good on this card. It's kind of good on like stealing an opponent's minion maybe. Depending on what we steal. Let's take the fishy. We'll take this uh, focused will. And we'll take this probe, nice. Wish we could get more probes. Draconic studies would be good. Also, these are all decent. Uh, let's take gift. Now that we took Spellstone, we have like a, a fun theme to the deck. Uh, we'll go huge turd over some small turds. Deliverance is pretty hot. Uh, Conjurer fun, but unfortunately, Deliverance is good. Tower Sergeant's okay too, for sure. Bombing Ritual is fun for our strategy. Uh, this is mostly poo. I'll take Violet Teacher, which actually kind of dilutes the pool, but so does everything here does. This actually puts a 3-5 in the pool that might matter. And Worm might matter. Night Captain? Probably still better than Deliverance, huh? But we got a theme going on here. Wretched Tutor. 100,000 parts again. Take Basilisk. And finally, I guess Nerubian Egg it is. Uh, never seem to find Draconic Studies. Bet on 7? I would say probably 5 at best for this one. Um, no Studies, no Death. None of the 5-5 five, five Death Rattle guy that draws cards. We'll lose on value and we'll lose on card quality, both. Um, you could bet on 7. I would then just caution people to make sure they're getting very good odds, or... You know. I would, I would be a little worried about this deck. This is my moment. 
Um, let's ditch it all. You might just overrate Hexen. Hexen's good, but one card for sure wouldn't carry this deck, like a Hexen or a Ysera, because the most of the deck is pretty underwhelming. You also have a lot of situational cards that could be kind of difficult to get off. Like the Spellstone, even like the Deliverances might not line up. The spells you get from your opponent's deck or the minions you discover might not be good. Which makes it seem like you'd have a better chance to win, but maybe their good cards are in their hand. Oh man, this card just costs one. Give a random friendly minion three attack. We could do that. Action is actually very good, yeah. Yeah, I'm not saying it's not very good. Just that having one very good card in your deck means one out of 30 of your cards are very good. And it's not always that good. Sometimes, again, it just doesn't line up the way you, you want it to. Take a trip. So you could play that two mana to get that trade, but I'm not that worried. But yeah, I think, um, honestly, I think Reconnaissance probably skews uh, Hexen's value a bit. It's a good card for sure, but... Give it Reborn. You know, it's kind of interesting. I want a copy of... Could play that. But like, this weapon is really oppressive, right? But if we just have a bunch of these... It's kind of nice. Right? Like, you can't just swing indefinitely into those. Next turn we can give a bunch of attack. We're, we're an aggro priest all of a sudden. He's skipping his turn. We're gonna wallop him. That's so much damage, right? That's 3, 6, 9, 12 from those. And now this is 15... 18? Priest out facing the hunter. Wall of his ass, we are. I, I, I wish... I hope we get a mini set soon, or some sort of... Even if they just rotated the sets, even if they didn't micro-adjust anything, if we got like a rotation, that'd be cool. Because I'm tired of winning and losing with and against Shaman, and to a lesser extent Demon Hunter, but I'm, I'm not the one... I'm not the one playing it, right? I actually just kill him. Guess I'm one off. Oh, no I'm not. That's a sick lethal. That's really cool. That was awesome. Truly delightful. Just drafted four Howling Abominations. That's normal, right? No. For my opponents, yeah, you'll probably be queuing into me soon. <laughs> probably at one and two. But uh, the most, I, I think I've gotten three. But I've played against somebody that played four against me on turn four, five, six, and seven, probably. I don't know. Within the first, like, ten cards of their deck. Eleven, maybe. They, were, they had four abominations. Uh, I'm going to keep all this. We got the Spellstone. It's going to work. Turn six going second against a Bloodseeker. That's pretty crazy. What a cool game. That was really cool. Got a tune with your name on it. I lead from the front. 
crazy when you buff this thing or actually even something like this, like just changing the number to one or three or something like that. Just makes hey we're playing cat lemon lime. Old old school Twitch and arena viewer slash player. Not old, just old school. Shoot it and get it. I can give his guy divine shield now. This one. Spirit already level 100. Uh, yeah, we're level like 106 or something. I haven't been playing as much. I mean, I've been playing a lot, but I haven't been playing as much. I'm taking some days off now. A couple expansions ago, we were like maxing out. I don't have any desire to. We just were. I didn't think honorable kill would be as interesting as it is. I think it's awesome. I was optimistic for it. I just think Night Captain is too common and too strong. But the honor of kill mechanic, it's cool. I think some of the honor kill cards are kind of bunk. Oh no. <laughs> do I even want... Um, do I want Divine Shield on this? Not really. I don't have a ton of ways to kill it. Uh, we could bump and then Mortal Coil and then try to find a real play. The, dip, the, the issue is we won't have Divine Shield on the, on the egg, but I think that's okay. Plus if I find a real 2 or 3, I'm, I'm a lot happier. Cat, I haven't seen her in ages. Cat was here... I don't remember exactly when Cat... I can't remember her exact handle. I don't know if I'm supposed to play that one. I'm not sure when I'm supposed to do that. It's very good in arena. Like, very strong or a very good mechanic? Because I think almost all the mechanics play out well in arena. The only one in like the last like two years that I can think of off the top of my head. The only ones I can think of like right away. In like recent at all semi-recent or recent history. I think I'm gonna take it now. Would be dormant, which I think was is mostly like a flub. I think dormant is kind of lame. Yes. And I think overkill way back was kind of like. I think they just didn't print enough good overkill minions. They're too understated even then. You can steal that, you think so? If I had a better play, I'd be... I've got plenty of I, I'd probably read the value, but yeah, it's fine. Inspire is six years old? Yeah. I actually think Inspire is a really cool mechanic too. And it was a really great arena mechanic when it came out, particularly. Probably had some constructed implications even back then, but it was a great arena mechanic. Adding value to your... Um, Adding value to your hero power, which we are going to use, is actually pretty interesting. Inspire was whack. Inspire was special to me. Wait, you said two different things. But yeah, anyway, that's a super old mechanic. If, if mechan the mechanic itself, I think it would be awesome if it came back. If you had, um... Like, an updated pool of Inspire cards. I'd be surprised if Hearthstone never revisits a mechanic. Maybe not, you know, this expansion or next, but like, Hearthstone's still around in five years, ten years. I'd be very surprised if they didn't have like a time spiral-like expansion that brought back a lot of keywords. There's one card that inspired was good and constructed, maybe two. There was that one that, um... There was the one that gave you a random spell, I think actually got used in control decks. Coda was good in Totem Shaman. Fat boy, what's up, fat boy? 
seem to not really revisit Inspire. Was there another Inspire card after TCG? They don't really revisit uh, keywords at all. And, you know, by design, they say. But I think that one day they will. A couple have come back now in small, like, uh, dual class cards or a couple of new dormant cards. But in general, they haven't done too much. Wait, did that really not kill this? That's not fair. You don't pick the they have some newer echo cards, yeah. They just won't give it the echo keyword, which is annoying, but... Like, we get, or maybe I get, annoyed by too many things. So maybe that shouldn't, uh... Echo's been used. They don't use the echo keyword, they use the echo effect. Off work. Had to work 45 extra today? Shit hit the fan. That sounds horrible. Do you work at the poop fan factory? <laughs> In which case that would be kind of like normal. So the drinks are strong. I have had a couple of sips of my whiskey and cola. I swear man, one whiskey and cola kind of... I feel it. I feel it pretty strong. Two whiskey and colas and I'm upside down some nights. They don't bring those back, but the mechanics, yeah. It's probably been some sort of... I mean, like, the mage hero power matters stuff is just Inspire, kind of like an upgraded version of Inspire. Keywords are too confusing for new players, allegedly. Yeah, I mean... This guy's gonna cast... Not wrong for Need three more? Alright, I think I'm just gonna play it. I think I'm gonna wait to play it. I think they dropped Inspire for good due to Demon Hunter Hero Power costing one. Base Stalker that puts a secret into play after using Hero Power is kind of Inspire as well, true. Words are confusing new players. New players in Hearthstone, yeah. I don't know why we're worrying about that. Three, four, five, six. Add a random ranked spell. I guess I don't care about getting the 1-1. One, one. I think I'd rather have the Toad. I you all. If they printed an Inspire card for Demon Hunter, it could be broken with the card that makes your HP cost zero. That would be fun. Oh yeah, that's true. Forgot that card exists. Mm, did you ever check Gwent? I never played Gwent. I actually haven't even seen much Gwent. Good news, Redbeard. I passed the Israeli bar and now I'm a lawyer. That is good news. That's incredible news. If I do that, it upgrades this to the max uh, capacity. Not too shabby. No one ones. But remember, you can't get multiple copies, so you could only get one one one. It doesn't really matter that there's ten one ones in there. It's only one of the ten minions that died or whatever. Three, six, nine. Jigor can defend you if you get sued in, in, in Israeli for s in Israel, sorry, for stealing toilet paper. That would be good. I would go to him. That 
I would go to him. What's that? Two wins? Two's pretty good. Dude, just playing Control Warlock over there. So much removal. That was a, a kind hearted lady we just played against. Kat Katia Lemon Lime. Vodka? Uh, this is a whiskey and a cola. I read Lawyer and I immediately think of Saul. That's good. I like Saul. This is my moment. Should I just keep Najak? Maybe. I'm not sure. Hello friends, what's up Koo? How's Logan? How are you? Katrina Lemon Lime sounds like a SoundCloud rapper. <laughs> yeah. You're right. I like playing different classes. Kinda wish Warrior was better. I like Warrior. What's your name? My name is uh, Zach. What's your name, Rodrigo Frita? Is it? Let me guess. Frieza? Tracking their movements. Mummy needs five more minutes. They can hit and then ping. That's something. Zachary, master of the schmackery. I'm a smack you, Night Rainbow. Because I'm the master of the schmackery. Remember what I said? Mummy needs five more minutes. You like that? Rodrigo. That would have been my second guess behind Frieza. Sabrina and Logan are fine. Thank you for asking. That's great news. And you're doing okay? Nobody probably ever checks in on Papa Koo. You wave your cards around like that. I'm gonna put the reverse hollows in my mouth. <laughs> yeah, I ain't slapping you with a reverse hollow. Oh, Those bad boys are sleeved and ready to sleeve if I. Um. I skip my turn? Just play that. Uh, yeah, you know what? Nope, nope, what does it say? Does it say no parents around? Is that what it says? Or oh no, my pants are down. I've said that before. I've heard that said to me before as well. I'm undead, not no friends dead. around? Oh. considered I don't hate it. Do I take that? What if he pings his own guy? <laughs> um, discover something in his deck. Uh, this could actually be sick if I can pull that spell stone out at some point. I've got plenty of I just tested po positive for COVID again. Take care of yourself. Take some water. Drink some water. Please. Please don't ping. Oh my god, why did he not ping? Nothing can stop me. Nothing. Who do you voodoo? Alright, let's play this. 
So if we draw the spell stone, it would be good. But sassy mon, take take care of yourself. I'm worried about you. What with getting COVID all the time. California having shortages in milk. Is that real? You want it? Come to Oregon. We got plenty of milk. You can have some of my milk, Scythe. Play the fishy, but I just like spending all eight mana on this guy. It's a pretty big threat. Omicron is affecting food supplies. Can't we just call things things that don't sound like transformers? That's great for us. That's. Did you just reveal no spells? Do not accept any of Red's milk. Nothing can stop me. Nothing. So wait, we know he doesn't have a spell, so I can't cast that. Oh no, that's actually kind of bad. Nice 20 mana. I mean, the back half of it was actually pretty good. One, two, three. He, had, he, he drew three cards for nine mana and froze my guy. It's not that good. It saved him seven, seven health. You've heard of Omicron, but have you heard of Redbearditis? I've heard of that one. Let's say I recommend getting that. So I guess I'm just holding this for Violet Teacher? Ay ay ay. We're gonna lose to a guy that played a rune and got a 10 mana do nothing. You can keep it for counterspell? Yeah. We have Spellstone, we have Violet Teacher, and yeah, maybe counter. Well, we know he doesn't have counter, I guess. Uh, in his, uh... In his deck. He might have it in his hand. If you, um, if you eat this... And he kills this, you're not gonna get the worms back, right? Your board's gonna be too full? You might get one back. Right? I never leave the farm for anything but beer, smokes, and food. Smart. Seems like a puzzle box or a rune is coming. It's three. That hits my face. Okay, it's okay. Uh, that hits my... not my worm. Okay. <laughs> Mistakes are how we grow. Did he already attack? He did? So he's dead? Oh no, it could be Flame Warda. Here they come. Kneel to the ice queen. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this poor guy. Covid may someday become a weak flu, but today is not that day. Of no symptoms, this time feels lighter than any fly. Or cold I've ever had. Flu, I think you meant. Um, well, just, that's good. Just don't overdo it, alright? Don't, don't, don't spread it to somebody else that might get feeling bad. Don't, don't go out and run a 10k marathon. That's a dud, um, celebrations pack, but that's okay. Onward we push. This is my moment. Pretty good copy of a thing, right? Some people get off on that stuff, that's true. Job's done. What do the bets look like? Mostly no. I don't know, I think the set could go three and three. I mean it could go twelve and zero, but Private Shorty reporting for duty. Depending I might just shoot his guy. So 
there was a 3 mana 3 3 that summoned a 3 3 with honor kill gain attack, it'd be pretty dang good, huh? I need to order more plastics. If I just order stuff off of Amazon, then when it shows up, I can just be like, oh, okay. That's good. Take his guy. I've got plenty of Shoot it. You wanted me to shoot it? Shoot what? Shoot my own guy? Or shoot the other thing? Or shoot the shit with you? I'll do that. May I have this dance? No, you may not. Fuck, don't go there. No. God damn it. I'm undead, not dead. An explosive sheep would be nice. Are you talking to me? I want a sheep? No, I hate sheep. So far, this deck isn't looking too bad. I didn't have as much faith as Night Rainbow had. Access denied. I rarely do. Wow, wait, he's leaving it up? Oops, what are you doing? Oh, you had an okay turn. Okay, that was one of the poorer plays I've seen. The message was delayed, now so we're referring to the 1-3. Okay, that makes sense. I'm with you, I'm with you. What the? I oh, they only have one Cosmog. A free win is always welcome, for sure. Our runs have been mostly good today, right? We had a 10. A 5. That's pretty nice. It's really like, did our gold go up or down, or did it stay the same? Like, did we get like 5 free packs? That's okay too, right? 12 and 0. Again, I feel it. You think so, fat boy? I don't know about that, but I'll try my best to win this one. This tech is fun. I know that. I always love cards like Lesser Spellstone that kind of gain value and grow throughout the course of the whole run, or the whole game. Gone so many 5-0 to 5-3. I think if you have a bad deck, and you take it to 5-0, a lot of times it'll go 5-3. And that's not really something you should feel bad about. I think if you have a really, really strong deck and you take it to 5-0, and then you play against other really, really strong decks and you find yourself losing all the time, um, then there's like, you can kind of identify, at least in part, that you need to improve your, your play. More of a 2-0 and a 2-3 player myself, that's not good. That's not a good rate. Pay attention, class. This ain't good. I'm a not play and watch Redbeard player mostly. Those are fine. Especially the part where you watch Redbeard, that's my favorite part. Those who are just solely not play players, 
It's not good for me. It's not good for me. Those ones that don't know who Redbeard is. Oh. I'm okay with that trade though. That's not a problem for me. Holy smokes. Wow. That worked out quite well. My six doesn't die to his four. His board does die to it. Wild. I mean, we might still lose, but that's... I got some turns of optimism out of that. In Italy, we never stop wearing masks. I don't know if there is... What US states have mask mandates? Most of the U.S. doesn't have mask mandates. California, I think, took it down for like two days. And I didn't know about it, so I was just wearing my mask still. It looks I like Oregon still so has a mask mandate. Dead. I don't know. A lot of websites that probably didn't exist before COVID that now exist tell me things about COVID. My university had like a month over the summer with optional masks. That was all. Yeah, California, they took it down, I, I think. Everybody, everywhere I went, everybody wore them. I don't know. Can I just wear it? So so what do we, I mean, I don't want to get into too too deep of a COVID discussion. Are we just going to wear masks all the time now? My buddy says he likes wearing the mask. I've barely gotten sick. I mean, even if COVID goes away, I kind of like... <laughs> I don't really mind wearing a mask. It keeps, I don't even get the cold. I haven't had a cold in like... Over two years. I feel like I never... <laughs> Oh, wonderful. Wearing a mask is the new thing? How long do you think that'll last? No masks in Sweden, I hate the masks. It fogs up my glasses. Yeah, mine fog, fog up my glasses too. Try to sometimes like pull it down. Which I guess defeats the purpose. My face is ugly, so the mask makes me hot. I enjoy crushing like you. I've got plenty of food. Someone found I um I mean not when I'm inside, when I'm walking around I pull it down. I like to use mask in bed with my girlfriend. She probably likes that too. To be honest, ever since we started wearing the mask, I haven't got a cold or anything, so I don't know if I really mind having to keep wearing a mask. Even after COVID, it's not a worry anymore. Yeah, right? You know what? It sucks that he killed that. Until my next turn. My next turn. <laughs> It'd be nice if Spammy was ganked and didn't go off. Yeah, that'd be good. No one can see my sweet makeup with my mask on, but they can be blinded by my luminous beauty when I take it off. Yeah, there you go. It's nice to blind people I, I found. 
only a boob would cast cube. That's what I say. Gotta save it for uh, some sort of value. I'm not sure of what kind. So how many packs do we have left? I'm gonna run out of packs. Would anybody else like to send me hundreds of dollars worth of Pokemon cards to open live on stream? I keep them all. I'm the one that gets all the joy. <laughs> you get some of the joy of watching me have happiness. The boob would cast cube. Turns out I'm the boob. Okay, let's open one that's not celebrations. I mean, we have uh, two chilling rain. Let's do one of these chilling rains. I gotta report back to Smalls and let him know what we opened so that he can feel shame for having purchased them or euphoria for having given us such delightful luck. All right, we'll do a pack opening. I like the way Cagbion thinks. Chilling rain. They call it chilling pain now on the internet in the pokey circles because, well, a lot of the cards are not... You don't always get the best cards, but that's okay. Oh crap. We already got a match. Scroll of piercing. Melanie. Expedition uniform. Boons sweat. Fru-fru. Diglett, let's go. Alexi Gilbert is reminding this people is to change their masks if doing activity. Wearing a mask and breathing heavy is a really good way to catch pneumonia. A dry mask is a good mask. You don't want a wet mask. Ooh, Cresselia, that's a rare. I actually like the rare reverse hollows. Dreads doesn't. Chat, chat doesn't, but I kind of do. And boom. I, I just kind of felt like we got a chilling pain, Passimian. Sometimes you got to feel the pain. It's not up to me. It's a druid. Um, maybe we keep fishy. Fishy's not bad. Reverse Cresselia is nice. Yeah. There's an ant. Inside, oh god. Inside Perfect here. Shelly Maybe he'll go away. I kind of smushed him. I, I just... Brooke's gonna get mad at me if there's ants all over the place. Yeah, Cresselia is cool. Piss Simeon, no pass Simeon. What am I feeding them? I think the remnants of a whiskey and cola from the night before. I'm just gonna heal. We can coin out the fours, or we can even coin piggyback and put ritual on it, maybe. We'll see what he does. Big shot okay, maybe I'm not doing that. Um. Alright, let's try... Could do that. If he has a buff, it's better to remove one now, I guess. Oh, we have the uh, Spellstone, that's great. I love having the Spellstone to start. He plays a 3 mana 3 2, a 2 mana 3 2, and a hero power, and he pushes a little bit of crap face. A charming composition. Hmm. I'm not entirely convinced I need to play that. I could play the four. A copy of a minion? That's fun. I know I know that. 
Alright, let's take this guy. If he can't kill ours, that's wonderful. Otherwise, we leave it up. We lose our board. We could have played like this and this and that, maybe. We'll be fine. Okay. It was that big. Delightful. Delightful. So I think we actually do this. Give this one reborn. I guess he'll just hero power that. But giving our guy reborn. Is that that good? Hmm. I guess it's fine, right? I mean, why not? Oh, smudge. This card would make more sense if your guy died. If the guy you took died and then this guy died, if it still gave him back. No? Oh, you know what I'm gonna do. I really like that card, I think it's cool. We could put it on there, but it's safe. That's upgraded, that's nice. I'm on a team, what do I do now? You have to start fighting. You have to fight against my team. I have to fight uh, Milkshake. Of an incredible nature. Really, you never learn. Grades getting low. Train that at least. New mod. Who's a new mod? Oh, Genzi man. Oh my god. Wow. New mod. Stressful. How are you, Genzo? Looking like a snow day. Snow all day Saturday. I'm excited. Nice. Oh man, I miss that Genzo back guy. A simpler time. When Genzi man's roamed the earth. What? He left up the... What is he doing? It's crazy. One, two, three, four, five, six. What are you doing, guy? Nature speaks we could trade it here first, I guess. Gave uh, King Parto... Man, I'm gonna play King Partosis next turn. Get a 7 drop with him. A Les with the Gen Z. I might start catching more streams. I started classes again. And I gotta wake up early. Nice. Well, if not, I'll miss you. If yes, I'm ha always happy to see you, Mr. Genzo. This is cool. This feels better, though. Listen. Listen. Uh, five, seven. They need to put more on the board, right? There aren't really many things. Ten minutes, five, five, and a random seven is not so bad. <laughs> no, it's not so bad. You're right. It's bad, but it's not so bad. 
but I think an 811 Wind Fairy on the board is probably a little better. Not really sure what he could. I guess he could put up a taunt. If he puts up a big enough taunt, I'll be your field guy. he could stop the Gidra. Here, watching while I work, getting paid to watch Redbeard. What a life! What an absolute life! Technically, Liquid and Jersey Mike's are newer mods, but there aren't newer non mod mods. Wait, Jersey Mike's is a mod here? Really? There a mod in this channel? Come on, Jersey Mike's, come on, give me some sandwiches. Getting paid to watch Redbeard in order to have many dollars to donate to Redbeard. That's smart. This is my moment. I like that. I'm really glad the segment five. I'd also be stoked if we picked up the Lesser Spellstone this first draw. I'm gonna take Jar Dealer. I have a 2. If I didn't have a 2, sure. Um, Mad Bomber could be good, it could be bad, but this could also give us some value, so. It's the chat command to get a sub delivered to you like a... Like a sub sandwich? Next prediction. Yes, there's a prediction for eight wins already in place, created and generated by none other than Mr. Night Rainbow. Mr. Professional Night Rainbow. I zoned out. That's okay. You did great. You're faster than me. Even while you're zoning out, you're fast. They should call you Flash Rainbow. Not due entirely to the time your pants fell down and the exposed your wiener. That was a mistake, you claimed. Let's go. Push them back. Does anybody have more than one million parts? g has got like five million. He keeps winning. <laughs> He's winning all of his bets all the time. Hey Gunny, welcome back to Twitch. Again, Gunny, the guy who swore he'd never be back ever. I'm happy to have you here. I really am. I don't mean to say I told you so, but I did tell you you would be here. G is the bet master. He is. He is simply the bet master. But remember, I always, as I always say, Mr. Night Rainbow, I'd rather be the bet master than the butt blaster, which is my current role in life. Blasting butts and so on and so forth. There's some loaded farters here. Jesse, how many farts do you have? How many? Oh no. Wait, oh yes, yeah, play your hollow abomination. I mean, play my hollow abomination. The courage of man the first time I ever actually wanted a hollow A bomb to be played. Only four more. I'm getting close to 2.3 million. Damn! Went back three times after eight months. Yeah, that's a lot, right? Because you said zero. Alright, that's mine now. You belong to me. Oh man, nine mana? I could take it and eat it. That's the sickest thing I've ever seen. I have three mana. You will not stop my quest. I've got plenty of to Oh man, I could just cube it next turn. I'll do that. <laughs> I'll do that. 
Someone comes back with such sweet sentiments and you condescend to them, so... Can you please show Gunny some greater respect? Can you give him the rose? That's not the right rose. Alez. Give him the gunny rose. Didn't even remember after all these years and all these times he's been back. I don't blame you though. Not all of us have the memory of a young Joe Piscopo. Uh... Oh god, I didn't get it right. <laughs> what is it? You have to type to get that. Oh, it comes up. Why does mine come up like that? It's a it's a better Twitch TV. Hold on. Gunnies are like the bootleg version. Well, yeah, I hope everything's been going well. Jokes aside, uh, what's that? 15, 16, and I can deal 10, 14. I'm undead, not dead. dead. I wish he didn't kill my guy. Alez, Redbeard, stop this. I was listening to that. Turbo Knight. Oh, frickin' heck. Dude! Killing me here, Larry. This guy's getting fresh with me. So, no! Seven, eight, nine, and I can deal ten. I'm late, but congrats on your new team, Red. Thanks, Genzo. I do appreciate that. This is so sick with this card. Can I ever hold off? Not really. Maybe. What's going on, Nimbus? Nice. That's cool. At least get us upgraded once. People need to stop taking back their cards. I know, right? I'm trying to cube them. I'm trying to cube them. I guess the card would be too good if it was like a 4 mana 2-6 or something. Made it hard to kill. It's kind of too good as it is. Without Zesty, the ship would sink and the butt would stink. Well, one of those things played out in true fashion. The stinky butt part. What's the best uh, thing we can get? One, two, three, four. I don't actually know. We could um, cube the 3-3 three, three version of that, but we're only getting a 4-4 four, four back, huh? Okay, let's see what we get here. Oh, that's delightful. Hmm. Who the hell is Redbeard? That's me. Quotes are the universal law of the universe. You can be very little denying that. I would certainly not. Discards his whole hand. Which is okay, because I'm just gonna resummon a board. A board of absolute and complete utter dog shit. That's fine. It's really good. No, what a draw. What a draw from the dirty dog himself, the dirty some sort of dirty piece of crap. So now he's tapping? As if one draw <laughs> as if one draw wasn't enough. This is a really bad spot for Deathwing. It worked out for him because his next top deck was premium, but man, can't even go face really. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He has 12, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Uh, so I just have to trade a little bit, right? Uh, 
Um, I could just trade there. Or face. One, two, three, four, five. I need two. Scum's down. From the 12, 16, 17, 20. So like one in maybe? Oh freaking heck. Is that good? It's not bad. 16, 17, 18. So he needs two damage. What deals two? Night Captain deals 16, 17, 18 heal. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm not sure yet. I legitimately haven't decided what I'm gonna do. I had a night captain or not I had a night captain. Eat the imp and rush the death rattle, true. Maybe I should have done that rather than heal and then run those in. It's better if he draws a pick crock. It's worse if he draws a taunt. Because then I want to probably be able to broom and kill a taunt maybe. So you can hit there, hit there, that doesn't do him any good. He has to, no, I guess he doesn't have to tap. Shit. Killing off the 4-8 looks solid. Yeah, it's definitely not bad. If his top deck is a taunt and you lose the brush, then you won't be able to kill him. He trades, he pushes. We need one damage. How do I find one? Missile launcher goes face or no? It does, right? Hey, deeper biggie. I'm undead, not dead, dead. If I rush it, it doesn't really change anything. I don't think. I'll hold it. Love this random track that came up with that boss knob. Who the hell are you talking to? You now kill off Deathwing with Broom. Yeah, I'm not concerned with killing Deathwing. I'm concerned with killing him. I find that to be a far more viable and fruitful strategy if I can pull it off. He's hitting with the 4 6. And actually trading, that's probably bad for us. If he doesn't know what the card does and hasn't counted properly, that's better. So yeah, he definitely shouldn't have pre-hit before tapping. So now he killed this guy for no reason, which is good. He did get the taunt, which is what we talked about. And we got the Siphon Soul. Blown to Electric Boogaloo. That was good for us. Do you recall what happened with Twitch? They're not allowing streamers to play music. They settled with labels? No. I put a new song in the Discord. Can you put it in chat too? I'll look at it. And we got Biggie here. Let's go ahead and open a Pokemon pack. I know that guy's rabid for pokey content. I don't- I gotta appease him. I haven't seen my friend Deeper Biggie in a really, really long time. Lots of decision making at the end, yeah. And... <laughs> it went in our favor. Okay, thanks Neely. Thanks for nothing. I mean, thanks for something, posting it. All right, Neil, you ready? Celebrations, it's time to celebrate. Last couple packs haven't been like the hottest. Uh, 
let's click that, let's click that. Nearly had that so ready. He did. He did exactly that. Alright, here we go. Fast as an F, boy. Nearly, don't let me down. Cosmog. Man, it really feels nice to hold them. Like my existence means <laughs> something. Yevital. Gotta go fast. Oh, don't worry, Les. I'm going fast. Stupid Zekrom piece of crap. <laughs> Flying, flipping Pikachu. I'm not gonna lie. I love this card. I think I got about 20 of them. That's cool. If you're gonna whiff on a classic card, you wanna find a Pikachu V Max back there. This song is great. What is this? What the? He's so chunky. See, so you're up in Oregon now. How are you liking it? I think it's great. It's kind of weird to live in a smaller town. But I suppose if I don't live in the greater Los Angeles area, there's only like four towns in the world that would probably feel like equivalent or bigger. And I never went anywhere. But I do think it's weird that it feels like there's nowhere to go, but I don't want to go anywhere. I don't like going anywhere. It's weird not being able to go somewhere. Like, I mean, I can go to a restaurant or I can go to a, you know, to a bar. But I can't, like, go to certain things, you know? It's interesting. I didn't think it would bother me as much as it does. It doesn't bother me a ton. I didn't think it would bother me at all. I love the weather. I love that I'm paying less in rent for a large one-bedroom apartment than I was paying for a studio. I like that Brooke is close by. But it's interesting. This song is phenomenal. What the hell is this? I just found this really cool song. It's called Scandroid. Wave oh, it's a Wave Shaper remix. Absolute banger. All right, it's on the permanent playlist. It'll show up again in the future. You get stream snipe much? Um, probably once or twice a stream at this point that I know of. Probably a few more times than that, realistically, but... Only, um... Probably only once or twice by, like, scheduled stream snipers. It's pretty good. I gotta remember, when, I, we, when we know we're getting stream sniped, I need to, um, I need to run a bunch of ads so that at least those suckers can give me, like, five cents. Yes, but how? Oh crap, I'm sitting here. Sorry, dude. It's like a song that would fit Arcane. Yeah, no, some of the Arcane tracks were dumb. Stupid Imagine Dragons in the opener. It really bothered me. It's awesome. Listen to Neo Tokyo, it's their best song. Yeah? Maybe their best song is this remix by our beloved Wave Shaper. Yeah, this is phenomenal. I give it a 8.5 out of 10. That's why this song sounds better than Imagine Dragons. Oh, you're gonna- oh! Can you just play a 3-3 that dies instead of a totem? I'm not trying to be rude, but what the hell are you doing? I hate dragons and I hate imagining things. You don't hate dragons. Was I here when it snowed? Yeah. Biggie, am I allowed to ask where in Oregon you're at? You wanna go grab a drinky poo? Yeah, it snowed. It was incredible. I really enjoyed it. Oh, he didn't... No, I'm, I'm not sure. That can't be right. No, it's a mistake, for sure. I'm trying to figure out what he's what he's got going on, though. I'm the cool thing is, like, sometimes this card comes down and you don't want to play too hard into it. These things just spit out. Alright, what did they say? Scandroid Tokyo something? Alright, let's see. Uh... 
This is a Dance with the Dead remix. Is there a, an original? A charming composition. All right, here's the original. I, it wasn't the original. Springfield. And hell yeah, if you're close enough. Let me look and see where that is. Spring. Field. Uh, what's happening? Hmm. I can give my guy divine shield. Then I can't put anything else out on the board. I don't know what the best play is. Um, I, I know what the best play would be if I didn't have this stupid thing on me. Hmm. Killing his stuff. Dance with the Dead Remix is better? Gotta be Dance Remix is the best collab. Oh you didn't tell me that. Take a trip. Come on, dude. Can I have my card back? I can get a three mana chitter. The guy already has. Oh my god, abominable cow. Thanks, cow. Guide my hand. I don't know what to do here. Play it? Play what? Oh, the song? I'll play it after this one. <laughs> I'm trying to play some damn earth cards. No time. Yeah, I wouldn't put this one on the permanent playlist. It's not bad, this is not like, not like super strong or anything, it's okay. Oh my god, the song's six minutes long. Right, let's try the will of the Forsaken is unbreakable. A lot of the Dance with the Dead stuff, I find a little too like, a little too crazy. But Abominable Cow, thanks for the four months. I swear, if you play this card, it just automatically adds this to their hand. I don't think I've ever seen it. Nose die? That's all I can do, right? These kills too relevant things. Uh, what was that card? Oh, this is better than the other one. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Permanent control gain tap. This permanent does one damage to our creature player. That's pretty good play. 
I could shrink that and maybe shrink that. I could silence that. It doesn't do me much good. We have to shrink those. Good, good, good. Bad. <laughs> Sorry. Spoke too soon. Darn it. Maybe I draw the um, Najok Hexon right now. And I take his guy from him. And it belongs to me now. Nope. <laughs> okay. Even good. This song is kind of cool. I kind of wish um, the character didn't sing in in this track. I feel like it'd be better if he did. I always play at 4:51 uh, a.m. Yeah, I work the night shift on Twitch. It's horrible. No, it's not. It's actually pretty nice. Thanks for your Yasera. Happy holidays. Dude, that's Fart City over here. Horrible. Abominable cow with the nice emotes. Who's is that? Who's BMK? Oh, is that Kibler? Kibler is like a professional streamer though. I'm still an amateur streamer. I got gifted a Kibler sub. Night Shift is the best. I haven't had to deal with a customer in five years. I have nothing but customers. And some of them don't buy anything. <laughs> but, uh... I like it. I, I don't know, man. I'm like... I'm almost never tired. And if I'm tired, I just go to bed. I'm like never asleep during the stream. I never feel like, oh god, I have to sleep during the stream. And if I do feel that way, I could just end. I just don't. Trash Queen? Is Trash Queen here? Trash Queen, do you demand by any chance that we open a Pokemon pack? Is that... do you demand that at all? You have a day job? No, this is it. So if you have a Twitch Prime, I'll take it, alright? I think so. <laughs> you think you demand it or you think you're here? Oh, for sure. Uh -huh. My moment. Okay, the bad news. I definitely poured too much whiskey and that's all whiskey. Ugh. Sorry for demanding that. That's okay. Remember, this is a gift from small. So A, we're we're in the black. Everything we open up here is, is pure profit. Also, it's just kind of fun. And now, the Battle Styles pack is done. And we, we won't have today? to get it, like, the next day. Trades there? I think I'm actually just going to take the trade. And we'll play this. Hope. There's, like, no way. If he plays a real 2 or coins out a 3, he might leave the piggy back up. Oh. 
We'll see. It's not gonna look like Dreads is luck tonight, is it? We got Mewtwo. Yeah, actually that wasn't so good, huh? Uh-oh. Hmm. Yeah, I could see how you could say that. You don't be bad if he had a bonkers sergeant and just does stuff. Is Marowak a rare? Yeah. Marowak was our rare. Your last card, the way we um, present the cards, I move them around before we show them. I uh, will always be our rare. Oh, we did have a bunker. That's totally not true, man. Except it doesn't actually matter that much. He has two of them. <laughs> that would be really not good. Oh, that's good. So he probably doesn't have another one. Maybe he does. An OG Charmander. What's the estimated value of an OG Charmander or Charizard? If it's an OG Charizard, I'm sorry, Charmander, probably like 15 cents, maybe? It's probably all chewed up. So I'd rather draw a card this turn, right? Someone's bound to come this way. <laughs> An original Charizard in like s even like semi decent condition is probably close to a hundred bucks, maybe. I mean, I could look it up for you. I'll look it up. I'm curious. Twitch, uh, eBay, eBay.com is a website. Base set Charizard. Spell? No, 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 no. Hundred bucks. Oh, that's base set two, sorry. Maybe more than a hundred bucks. Wow, this base set. Wait, what? This base set two sold for three hundred and twenty-five dollars. Okay, more than whatever I said. If it's in really poor condition, it's probably still worth a hundred bucks. Wait, these base set twos are two hundred and fifty dollars. I have Brooks just sitting here. Maybe I should get it in a top loader. Okay, you know what? I think I'll actually do that. Charizard's are expensive. No, it's like mint in a sleeve and everything. Charizard or Charmander? If it's Charmander, it's probably not worth much. If you sent it to a grading company and spent like $80 and it's in absolutely perfect condition, which most of them that don't most of them don't get opened in that condition Even in 1999 Would probably be worth like two 200 bucks, maybe But most most cards are not in that condition Necessary to be worth that amount of money Charmander. Yeah, probably nothing. I Could look it up for you if you want ungraded base set I could tell you exactly how much the last one sold for on eBay. I will tell you that because I'm also the curious. Of man shall not if if it's in really really good condition, maybe two dollars. If you got one graded in perfect condition. 
Which there's only like six in the world, it'd be worth $87. But you have to spend like $50 probably to get that card created. I'm not trying to like shit on your Charmander or anything. He's probably awesome. And you should cherish him. But he's probably not. I hope you have not leveraged his value to make any personal investments because. It will not pan out for you unless it was on a pack of gum balls. Um, we're gonna open this celebrations pack now because we have Trash Queen over here just screaming at us. Open more, open more, Redbeard. Does it feel like I was shitting on that guy? I'm not trying to. All right, let's queue up while we do it. Boom, Groudon. He looks sick, man. All these base set cards look awesome. And the great news about getting Palkia in the second card is that we can't get Palkia in the third card. <laughs> Team Rockets Zapdos. Not a super valuable card either. Probably about the same value of that gentleman's Charmander. But it looks sick. I haven't opened a Zapdos in a while. Really cool. And a flying Pikachu V. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and count that as a double banger. Double banger. Wow. Let's get the Zapdos in sleep first. Wow. Great centering. Mm -mm. Great surface. That's a PSA 10. Go ahead and double that value <laughs> to $6. I gotta sort this. <laughs> Got this ever growing pile of Pokemon cards around me. It's stressing me out. Very cathartic to uh, to actually sort them. Also, I really need to pee. Um, I gotta keep these all together so I can show Smalls everything we got from here. We got the surfing Pikachu. We got the flying Pikachu. We got the surfing Pikachu V Max. All we need is the flying Pikachu V Max, and then we got all the Pikas from the base set. Imagine getting spanked by piggyback while playing two active bunkers. Yeah, that's what happened to him, huh? We got seven wins too. You get to end on an infinite run. What an abs. Okay, it was a team rocket. Team rockets ground on. I just bonked. Uh, not team rockets. Just a regular ground on. I find organizing them relaxing, me too. I find having a big pile of them unorganized to be an overwhelming thought and very stressful. And then you start organizing them and it feels wonderful. I'm looking forward to it. In fact, Neil, don't tell anybody. Sometimes I let the pile grow to... to great heights. For just that reason. <laughs> I don't know if I want this one. I guess this maybe is better. If I pick up the Reborn card, it's probably... I don't know. I locked my opponent out for three turns in a row with Snowfall Guardian and killed them from full health. That sounds horrible. Oh, right. He has that card. I'm pretending like I got the best card ever. Alright, I got those all sleeved up. I really need to just order sleeves right now. So that in a week they're clear. You monster in arena, yeah, yeah. I got that. Another uh, piggy or a void ripper. I mean let's just take these. I have no idea. When I was a kid, I went to a friend's birthday party and we stopped to buy some packs as his present. Mom let me have one of the packs for myself and open it. Open a hollow Venusaur. I was crazy excited until my mom told me I had to give it to him because it was the kid's birthday. That kid turned out to be a criminal, probably.
Despicable. I don't know what he's thinking. Oh, oh wait, it's Cat again. Wait, we're playing Kat Katia. We played Cat earlier in the run. Cat had like seven full blown evils, I remember. Or at least one that we kept getting from our spells. That's nice that Cat had a pretty decent run. Delightful, an endless, a literal endless stream of best lips. When I was a kid, we bought we opened packs here and there. I can't remember exactly how many packs I must have opened. I had decks, so I must have opened up a, a fair amount of packs. Um But I bought one, I remember buying one. I have I have some base set first edition commons and uncommons that were in a binder. So I, I must have bought at least one. I, I know I bought one pack. I might have bought like two or three, but I think I only bought one. I have the contents minus the holographic first edition Venusaur I opened, <laughs> which I bought the pack for $10. And I, I, I'm fairly certain I sold it to the shopkeep on the spot for $40. And I it might have been 50, but less than, it was either 40 or 50, I think it was 40. And honestly, that was a great investment. I used those $40 to buy 40 bitcoins when they were one penny. And now I'm the richest man on earth. I ended up with five wins. I don't know if I'm bad or I thought the deck was worse than I thought. Probably both. Probably a combination of the two. Like a mix. I don't need any of you. Gosh darn it, cat, stop this. Stop this madness. I felt the games were really hard because I didn't crush. Yeah, so sometimes you just get a bad matchup, and I don't actually think it means you're bad or your deck was bad. Sometimes you just, oh my god, we got time spiral. I missed that. Got a tune with your name. Uh oh. This ain't gonna be good. Rich chat. I, mean, I love that card. We know Cat has another one of those. <laughs> Missile Launcher is certainly going to be useful. That's sarcasm, right? I tried playing Arena. I got offered only two drops in the last 10 cards. And I was upset at how shitty the card quality was. A lot of the two drops are really good. Maybe you could have built a, like an awesome deck with two drops. Katie Allen time? That's that's the lady, yeah. Oh my god, how many packs do we have left? One, two, three, four. He's sort of open four. Alright, here we go. If I was Warlock. Well, looks like the fourth best class, I think, right now. Pretty, pretty definitively the fourth. Uh, yeah, I think this deck going seven is probably good. Uh, close to eight. It did better than I thought, but against the better decks, we really kind of got showed what what it was like. What are the best classes? Uh, Demon Hunter has the highest win rate. I think Shaman is the best class. And Rogue is probably the second best class. And then um, 
Demon Hunter's good, and then Warlock. Uh, 